When you're traveling in Japan, the last thing you want to do is walk 20 minutes to your Airbnb or hotel on top of navigating through the subway all day. And if you've never been to Japan, there will be a lot of walking. If you clicked on this video, it's probably because you're looking for someplace budget friendly yet nice and comfortable, right? As much as you want to live it up in the familiar Four Seasons, Intercontinental, Marriott, or Hilton, it's going to cost you about $4,000 on average for two weeks just for the hotel. Now, what if I told you you can stay someplace comfortably for a total of less than $600 for two weeks? And you don't even have to walk far to the subway station because it's right outside your door. By no means am I sponsored by them, but because it worked out so well for me and my party, I wanted to share this gem with you. It's the Sotetsu Fresa in Toyocho in Tokyo. It's a chain that has multiple locations throughout Japan, but for today, we're just going to talk about the Toyocho location. Within the block, you have a Lawson, Family Mart, and 7-Eleven. McDonald's is right next door and in the lobby, there's a cute little cafe called Pronto. Around the block, there's a self-service restaurant I came across called Matsuya and I'm obsessed. I went back twice and wish I could have gone once more. It's so simple but delicious and just cost $5 for the bowl. While there may be cheaper hotels in Tokyo, you want to make sure you have easy access to the subway station without walking too far and have food options around. A nice neighborhood is also a bonus. This is us coming up from the subway station and heading to our hotel. Look how close it is. You can pay, check in, and receive your key at the kiosk in the lobby. There's also an assortment of free amenities like bath additives, facial cleansers, tea bags, combs, and more. The cool thing is, if you're like us and you arrived way earlier than check-in, you can ask the front desk to hold your luggages while you explore the city and come back later. They'll have your luggages sent straight to your room when it's time to check-in. Just like any hotel, Prices may fluctuate depending on the time of year you're visiting and the type of room you're choosing. So Tetsu offers 17 different types of room. I didn't even know that was a thing. As of September 1st, 2023, the average room is between $45 to $60. That's already cheaper than most hotels. If you're like us with three people to a room, that's $15 to $20 per person for a day. All that money you just saved can go towards the rest of your trip, especially since you're just using the hotel to rest in for a few hours. So Tetsu Toyocho is between Shibuya and Tokyo Disneyland, so if you're planning to hit up those places, it's quite convenient. Tsukiji Fish Market is 24 minutes by subway, 18 minutes by car. Tokyo Disneyland is 36 minutes by subway, 17 minutes by car. Tokyo Skytree is 27 minutes by subway, 18 minutes by car. Shibuya Crossing is 35 minutes by subway, 29 minutes by car. And Haneda Airport is 42 minutes by subway, 19 minutes by car. But here's a little hack. There's a limousine bus that stops across the street and Sotetsu Toyocho just so happens to be on the limousine bus's route. If you watch my first Japan vlog video, you'll know that the limousine bus is a quick and easy way to get to and from the airport. But unlike a regular city bus, there are limited routes and stops. Overall, Sotetsu Toyocho has you covered with transportation. Subway station right outside and airport bus across the street. On top of saving money from the hotel, it's a lot cheaper to take the metro than the taxi, so you really can't go wrong with the location. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a thumbs up to let me know. I also have a great hotel recommendation for Osaka that's walking distance from Dotonbori, where I'm sure you'll spend an entire day. Thank you for watching and see you soon!